As you can see from this Enchanted Learning website, a prefix is a group of letters that you put before the root of a word. So you could take the word happy and put un before it, which means not. You put them together, it means not happy. A suffix is a group of letters that you put after a root word, and it changes the root word. Um, the example they used here was if you put less after flavor, that means without flavor. On this website, there are some examples of prefixes, meanings, and some examples. Feel free to pull this up so you can see it also. You want to be really careful when you're listing prefixes and suffixes. What I notice a lot of you do is you'll take a word that has something like D and E at the beginning, and you'll put that as a prefix, you'll list it as a prefix, but the word is one of those tricky words that actually doesn't have a prefix because it doesn't have a root that could stand alone. Some examples of words that seem like they have prefixes but don't, these tricky words I've listed right here, there are lots of them. These are just a few. So you want to be really careful and you want to really think about the word. So for example, if your word is disastrous and you think dis is a prefix, look at the rest of the word. Asterisk. Have you ever heard that word? Does that exist on its own? If you look it up in a dictionary, are you going to find that it's something that could stand by itself without the DIS? And you'll find that it's not. So don't just put any word or any combination of letters that start a word or any combination of letters that end a word for prefixes and suffixes. Your secret code word to put in your homework planners is untitled. <laughs>